Day eight. I can't believe that it's day eight already. Anyway, I thought we could talk about all of my favorite pots, planters, things that I have. I have quite a bit, so let's just jump right into it. This is made in Italy, and I think, oh man, where did I get this from? We got this from a plant shop in Chicago, and it's so pretty. It comes with a saucer, but I'm not quite sure where the saucer is. I didn't have time to look for it. But it's concrete, and just like the edging around it is just so, so pretty. Love it. This one I got in Arizona. Oh no, I can't remember the name of the shop, but it's so pretty. It's the inside is like a ceramic or a terracotta, but it's glazed on the outside and has this beautiful detail on it. Oh, I have it in a video when I went plant shopping with Adam in Arizona, last time I was out there. Okay, another one I got in Arizona, <laughs> in Tucson, is this beautiful planter. This is hand painted in Mexico. And I got this the day that I met Becca de la Plants. And actually, I have a cactus in here that's not potted directly in this pot. The plants I had in here was my old man cactus that died. Rest in peace. So I just popped that in there for now because I love this planter and I needed to use it. Okay, here is one that I got at, at home in Arizona when I was visiting my mom. It's terracotta, but it has like some cool like sculpting on it and some white lines. It's just different. And I love bowl pots. I don't know. They're nice for cactus gardens and they're just, they're some of my favorites. Okay, this set that I got, I actually picked these up at a garage sale and they're these short little terracotta pots, but they're glazed on the outside with these different, like almost like antique colors and they have little feet. This one, I just did like a little cute little succulent cactus garden in and I haven't done anything with these yet. So maybe I can do something with these soon but this has like kind of like the same pattern and then this one is a little bit smaller this would probably only fit like one cactus but still super cute okay let's scooch i found this i believe at walmart this is a concrete cactus planter it does not have a drainage hole so i use this as like a propagation vessel like i'll put a little glass bottle in there and just use it as like a cash pot. Another one I got in Tucson. I like Arizona, guys. I got this at EcoGrow in Arizona, and it actually has a cactus in there, but it says Tucson on it, and I thought that it was so cute. When I saw it, I had to get it. I just opened this in a unboxing this past Monday, and it has a little succulent in it, but look at that face planter. Isn't it cute? If I can remember where I got these from, and like the shop names, I can't off the top of my head, but it'll be linked in the description below. Okay, now this might be one of my favorites. This is actually Mia's, and I got this at Walmart, and it has <laughs> her patch of podium in it. And I just think it's so cute. It's a little llama, and there's no drainage hole, so you gotta be careful. I'm sure you can create drainage holes in terracotta and concrete pots, but I just haven't tried it yet. But I love that one, that one's super cute. Another one with no drainage hole. Can't remember where I got this from, but I'm using it to hold my Bonsai Jack Lava Stone. But it's just really pretty. It's like a different color it's ceramic. So it's not, it would be easy actually to make a drainage hole in this one. This is a little different. I just recently opened this too last Monday. This is holding my air plant and it's a cute little reindeer. Isn't it cute? You could probably also put like a little tea light in there. So not your typical pot, but I thought it was cute because it's holding an air plant. Okay, another one I unboxed last Monday. This has my Philodendron Royal Queen in it, and this actually is being used as a cash pull because this is in LECA. So I have a net pot sitting in this one, but isn't that pretty? I love the pattern on that. Okay. This is also for LECA plants because no drainage hole. This is from Ikea and this holds the five inch net pot, I believe, perfectly. But I think it's really cute because it's like a, maybe ceramic, maybe plastic, I don't know, but it looks like terracotta and I love it. I like how it has that little lip at the bottom too. Okay, this one I got from Walmart. <laughs> I said like Walmart for pots. <laughs> This has llamas on it too. I thought of Mia when I got it, but I definitely stole it. It's got my, 
It's got my blushing Syngonium in there. And I just think it's cute. It's ceramic, but I love stuff that's hand painted like that. And then last, but certainly not least, another one from Walmart. I've seen you guys have these. Like I've seen quite a few people have this one. It says, give me the dirt on it. <laughs> And it has a drainage hole and it's very heavy. It's heavy concrete, but I just think it's super cute. Okay, what do you think? I would love to know what some of your favorite planters are. Do you prefer ceramic? Do you prefer terracotta? Do you prefer cash pole and like plastic? What do you prefer? Let me know in the comments below. All right, guys, I'll see you tomorrow for day nine. Bye. Hold up, I am on my way, I'm in motion Let's go to the ocean Yeah, let's go out to